President Barack Obama set a new tone for his second term Tuesday night. It is our unfinished task to make sure that this government works on behalf of the many and not just the few. Uncompromising and aggressive, Obama wants to boost the middle class. Also on his to-do list for the next four years, immigration reform, gun control measures and a climate bill. It's a message Democrats approve. I think he gave a very strong speech. This was a vigorous speech. This was an ambitious speech. This was a guy who feels like he's winning the argument. But Republicans have already made it clear they're not in a mood to cooperate. Last night, the president offered up more of the same. Higher taxes and more stimulus spending. Public reaction was also mixed. In a move that cheered union leaders and annoyed the business community, the president proposed raising the hourly minimum wage. It's time that the, uh, the bosses and the people making the most money in this country start giving it back a little bit. So I'm all for minimum wage raising and increasing as inflation does. But cafe owner Delsa Bernardo is worried. I may not be able to meet those expectations right away, especially with the economy. So it's a little concerning for right now. In Miami, a city famed for its vibrant migrant culture, Obama's push for immigration reform was welcomed. He's got some great, 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 great plans, especially on immigration and the economy. The issue has the kind of populist appeal that Obama can and will take directly to the American public. We can do right now. Tracy Brown. Associated Press.